Hello. It's night number two. Night two. So tonight, yes, yeah, Jacob. Like it's, it's not raining. It's not a downpour. So it's work. It's, beautiful. it's really nice. So we are gonna do more. We're gonna do scare zones for sure tonight, and we're, we're gonna try some food. <laughs> We're definitely gonna try the last of us food. That's what we're gonna start with tonight. Um, we might do some houses once it gets dark, but we're gonna try to soak up the daylight when we can. So, you can see behind us, it's Saturday. And it's, it's crazy. Insane. Yeah. But it's not like a monsoon like it was last night. That's I honestly though, I would prefer the monsoon because then it Same. like flushes people out. Same. So, um, we still have like, I think like, 30 minutes before we can get any food and characters come out so we're just gonna hang out so, they're yeah. still setting up anyway they they're are like wheeling cars and yeah i can show you guys some of the props stuff. that they're rolling out so they're uncovering all of the stands this one's like like a a concession stand at the music fest and then the one down here i think that's my favorite it's like a merch stand that one's fun and then we have the bus. The bus was obviously used for the purge and trick or treat. It was both used for those. I don't. It's, I probably is used for many other things. You got a lot of use out of that. Those bus. are the two I know. But Jacob, Jacob did mention he was like they used to cut this whole Saiyan cream off right by Auntie Anne's through Grinnigan's, so they could set up the props. But now it's like they're trying to set up the props and have all these lines weave through. In and out. But they need all the space. Like, look at this. I know. It's still full. Unfortunately, all these people are going to be very disappointed with Stranger Things. But. He was here. Ew, oh my god. Yeah. There's an eyeball in the tip jar. This is the hippie. Here's the house. So we saw this one was open already because we saw people with tested taters. So we are going to get the corn dog. Might as well just get some twisted taters since we're here. The infected ones look good. <laughs> Like these are gonna be messy. Probably. Like they're gonna have like a bunch of seasoning. Yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> a bunch of seasoning and stuff on them. Yeah. So just to let you know, I got the infected taters. They seemed a little confused um, because they asked me what seasoning I wanted on it, but I said I wanted the specific infected ones. Um, but you can add whatever seasoning you want to the infected ones. So, this is awesome. You want me to go first? Dig in. Do I try to eat it nicely or just go for it? I would just eat it off the stick. Is it good? Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah. Because you're not a big corn dog person. I didn't actually get any dog yet. Oh. I just got like, because there's like, it's like cheese milk too. Oh, nice. It's, it's beefy. It's good, yeah, beefy. So it was worth the $11 or whatever. I think so. Nice. All right, I've never got these. So it has like a mushroom sauce on it. The mushroom sauce is really good. Is it? Did you get some on yours? Yeah. It's, it's good. good. Yeah, it is good. Mm -hmm. And it's not like overpowering. No, I will say these are soggy. But the sauce makes up for it. Because usually they're so dry with just the seasoning. Yeah. So the sauce helps. And it was funny because at first the lady did it and then the guy was like, do some yeah. more. <laughs> he was like, we got plenty of sauce. Yeah, it was, they're good. Good. Good first stop. All right. 
So this is where we just got food. We're just gonna head right over here because this is where the Yeti stand is and this is where the poutine lives. I think we're gonna try some of this because it sounds delicious. This is what the menu looks like. I think we're gonna go for the vegan one and not the Asian one. But it looks good. And that's what it looks like. It's cool. It's very like Canadian style. There it is. It looks the good. poutine! I will say when they gave it to me, it's super hot, so that's a good sign. So this is the... did you share which one I was getting? Yes. The vegan it's one. It's the vegan one, yeah. Not the the Asian inspired. The bloody campground one is like the Asian one. Yeah. Let's give this a try. I feel like it's gonna be really hot though. It'll probably be pretty hot. Well, the, gra like the gravy's probably super hot. Wash it down with a cold drink because there's no ice in the thing. It's not that corn dog. No. But the corn dog's hard to beat though. But it tastes like meat to me. No. So you it's can like, taste there's there's it's definitely there's like mushrooms. So is it good or bad? <laughs> you just said it's it good. wasn't as good. It's as good. I won't get it again. No. But it's good. I would eat okay. this all. All right. Yeah. So I took a, like a few bites of that poutine, but. It's getting like warmer out now, so I just, it was okay, it wasn't great, but I threw most of it out. It's not that corn dog. Get the corn dog. Touching you.
how'd you feel about that one? It's cool. It's I don't. Cool. I think I, only a few of the costumes are really cool in that one. I think a lot of like it just they, oh, some of them were just kind of like they had huge like black just like ropes on, so that's not really impressive. But uh, yeah, and they're all pretty like pretty much all the costumes are really similar. They're just different color. Yes. They all look like, really shiny. Yes. This one I'm super excited for. We, we did walk through it quick last night on the way out, but we didn't see it during the day. So. Yeah, I like the theme. Yes. Let's try this one. This is Jungle of Doom. Did li I liked um, Jungle of Doom. It's a good one. I liked how it was like different. It wasn't just like animals. Yeah. Like I liked their costuming a lot. It was cool. It was cool. Yeah. It was kind of like a crossover of like The Lion King on Broadway yeah, and The Last of Us. <laughs> That's what it's I thought. What they were thinking. They were like, I know. Let's do a scare zone. Yeah. Part The Last of Us, part The Lion King. Yeah. So we're making our loop. Um, they don't like. They don't have the uh, chainsaws in Simpsons anymore. They didn't have them last year either. No. And I don't really know why. It's fine by me. <laughs> Do I know what Diagon Alley feels like? Empty. It's so busy in here. I can't even handle. It. I know. So obviously they're not out yet. There's gonna be one there. Here, probably, and over there. Now, Hollywood has had um, them in the past. We're th this is the first year for us. Why do you run so fast? <laughs>
That was amazing. That was awesome. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Yeah. It just kind of happened. But I'm glad because they did. When we, when we were in Hollywood, were they there? I think they were. They were. They were, but we, we could not see them in Hollywood. It was like chaos. But we timed just perfectly. That was great. That was great. That was great. I was happy. <laughs> see, now they're gone. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Well, that was, I mean. So they came out at. Six, like 6.45. 45. 6.40. So they were out for And then they're like running minutes. sprints for 20 minutes. And then they did their little show. Well, the one, the first one scared me because I just saw some guy do like, yeah, lighting for us. And yeah. I was like, what happened? Yeah. That was fantastic. That was great. Good job, Universal. Yeah, the sun's in a good spot. It is. We never come in here at HHM. Do you think of, no. do you think of Harry Potter as like more Christmassy or Halloweeny? Well, it depends. I feel like I certain mean, ones are Christmassy and certain ones are Halloweeny. Well, Hogsmeade is Christmassy because it's always snowing. Yeah. I feel well, like the early think. ones are definitely like people because I mean they're always on like Christmas. They always do like a Christmas marathon for whatever reason. Yeah, I don't know. So I feel like because I feel like a lot of the movies. I feel like always, the first Christmas. four are Christmas, maybe five, and then the last three are because, Halloween. That's because like. The movies get, get darker as they go. Rawr! That's because the later movies get darker. Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. I do love the set pieces in this one. But, I mean, so what I'm seeing of the costumes so far, it's kind of weird. Cute can. <laughs> Is that 
the can is what makes it. Yeah, pretty much it is that. What? Chef Porter. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I can literally see your shorts from across the park. <laughs> Look at my shorts. <laughs> Like, <laughs> All right, I'm gonna wrap this video up. Um, I just, I really want to show you guys the scare zones and try some food. Um, so we're gonna still hang out. We're gonna um, do some houses now because it's getting dark out. It's beautiful out. Best night for HHN. Um, so yeah, we'll be back. Um, possibly with Thea. We might bring her just to see to do Diagon Alley. Maybe next week, depending on weather. Um, so yeah, it was it was a really good night and really good food. So.